In the previous video, we defined setting so that we can get all the defined files from a given computer through Resource Explorer. Now in this particular video, we will understand how we can share this set of files in a structured report format. Also, if we want to count how many devices have specific file or specific product, or if we want to compare software inventory between two computers, everything we are going to see in depth in this particular video. Along with that, if there is a data mismatch with the report and the current state, what could be the reason? All this we are going to see in this particular video. If you are yet to subscribe to this particular channel, then please click subscribe so that you get more updates related to MECM and click the bell icon to get instant notification. This is your host Yagnesh Malavia welcoming you. To get this entire data in a report format, we will go to monitoring tab within that reporting reports and we will see software files. Over here, we will see a few options. I will go to all inventory files on a specific computer. I need to enter the host name and click view report. So all the files that are present, we will see it entirely over here. This entire report, we can export it in Excel, CSV, and this can be shared to the management. Computers with specific file. Suppose there is a requirement to see how many devices there is a particular file that is present Then this option will be really very useful So if I enter this particular value file name as win I click view report I am seeing no data however, if I use percentage sign and Click view report. I will see the information because there are file name which are having a name when in somewhere in that particular file so file name and the location of the path with the host name is shown over here so this particular information may turn up very useful as per the requirement similarly if we just want to see on how many devices that particular file is present so same thing we can do it and over here we will see the count of devices so if you see there's a count one one so this particular file which is there is present in one computer now the next one compare software inventory on two computers if i click over here this report will show the differences between the software inventory reported for two selected computers so i need to enter the host name fccl01 and the other host name is FCDC01. If I click view report, so over here it will show the differences between the software inventory reported for two selected computers. So I'm not seeing any information for FCDC01. Let us understand the reason why. For that, we will go to the report which is site discovery and inventory information. Over here, there is a report name inventory dates for a specific computer. If I run this particular report and I enter the host name FCCL01, I will see this information FCCL01, last hardware inventory scan 193, last software inventory 243. So let's check the other machine FCDC01. I click view report last hardware inventory scan is 20 to 3 however last software inventory is not there now you would be getting an answer that why that particular device information was not present because that particular software inventory cycle has never been executed on this particular device so for troubleshooting purpose there are chances where if the software inventory collection cycle date is of older date and we are trying to compare then also we will see that the data is mismatched so if we are comparing with the current state it's important that there is a recent date time stamp in this particular software inventory collection cycle also we can see the same information in the asset and compliance if we go into this particular device here you will see hardware scan software scan Right now we are more focused on the software scan. You are saying 24.3, 123. 
and FCDC01 software scan is blank. So that particular software scan has not happened and because of which this information is not shown. So this is very important with respect to troubleshooting purpose that we see recent date timestamp. For that we can go over here, right click, client notification and collect software inventory. Or else on the local machine we can go to config manager properties. That is this and run the software inventory cycle. So in case if you are seeing the data which is not recent or not showing, there are high chances to review the software inventory cycle, run it so that you can get more recent data. In the next video, we will see how we can configure hardware inventory cycle so that we can get more information on hardware as well as application installation through Resource Explorer. If you like the content that I am sharing, then please like and comment because that really helps me to understand I am creating a positive impact in someone's life. Also request to please subscribe so that you get periodic updates related to MECM. With this, this is your host Yagnesh Malavia thanking you for watching this particular video.